Families prepared to celebrate East Texas school districts are taking extra steps to keep everyone safe. Our Garali Jayswal joins us now with the details. As school districts like Longview ISD and Tyler ISD prepare for graduation week, they tell me their main concern is creating a safe and secure environment for friends, families, and the students on graduation night. All the TISD police department employees, all the policemen will be at the stadium both nights. Uh, our safety and security department will be there also. Tyler ISD's school resource officer, Danny Brown, says the district is ready. He wants families to be ready, too. There is uh, going to be a clear bag policy and there's going to be uh, law enforcement at the event. Because we don't want anything getting in there, fireworks or any of that, because that you know, could cause injuries. This year, Tyler ISD is also putting an emphasis on traffic control. After graduation is over, uh, we're going to have officers on Front Street, on Lyon Street, and on Houston Street to get everybody out quickly. A few more things to keep in mind. Balloons are not allowed inside Rose Stadium. And families should meet graduates at Mike Carter Field after the ceremony. Go to Mike Carter where your, where your graduate's going to be getting their diploma. And if anyone sees anything suspicious during graduation. Be sure and tell us so we can make it a safe event. Brown wants to emphasize taking safety precautions post graduations as well. Parents, get with your kiddos and make sure you know where they're at. Bottom line, both Longview ISD and Tyler ISD want to ensure the events as safe as possible. We just want our families and kids to have a great time. I'm Narali Jaiswal with CBS 19. Narali, thanks for that report. Tyler ISD graduations begin this Wednesday and continue through Saturday. And Longview High School seniors are set to graduate this Friday, May 19th. Congratulations to all you graduates.